Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. My name is Sniper. If you're new here, nice to meet you. If you're not, welcome back. Today we are playing House CD as you guys can see right here. So today there was an update um, because it's Friday, of course, and they update on Friday. So we are posting a video on an update because we always post videos about updates on this channel of most games that we played concurrently on this channel so if you enter the holy temple as you guys can see the countdown is now gone for the almighty and also in the hell zone i went ahead and beat every single one of these guardian rooms just to beat them uh i don't think you actually have to beat all of them to get into the last zone i'm not really sure i haven't really checked but we did anyways let's just say my teams are probably not the best but they work so before we get into this we're going to go over the discord update log per usual and then we will hop into the games and beat the bosses as you guys seen by the title so let's go over to the discord and check out the update log okay so now we're over in the discord and as you guys can see today at 9 4 a.m it says the temples are open take on the almighty and hell reaver two new maps added i'm not going to read all the extra stuff but two new maps added of course and two new heroes added two new heroes so i guess you get a hero when you beat this I'm not sure. Uh, I haven't checked that out, but we're going to see that in a second. That's pretty much all the update was. It wasn't a huge update, but it was an update. We're going to go ahead and beat the boss. So we're just going to go back to the game and start on the heaven boss because the hell towers already have equipped. And then we will go over to the hell after we beat the heaven and do that. So let's get into it. Okay, so now we're back in the game. So now you go over here to the holy temple. You go through here and boom, it doesn't have a countdown and you could press just play now. So let's go ahead and play now. Sadly, I won't be buying anything like I normally do in the videos, but uh, I may be buying stuff in other games coming up. So uh, before we get into this, of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below the question of the day, which the question of the day today is going to be, what is and or was your favorite subject in school? I'm currently not in school right now. I'm just working working a job and doing this on the side but when I went to school I would say probably in high school my favorite subject was auto which is basically you work on cars and uh, learn about cars and I just I don't know I always always had fun in that class compared to other classes and I, I it's pretty cool I don't know I always found it entertaining more entertaining than most stuff for me but let me know down in the comments what your favorite subject in school was because that's the question of the day and that's how we get to know each other on this this platform so yeah let me know down in the comments and as always don't forget to turn on the bell notification to get notified every time i upload because you don't want to miss that because usually i upload on days that i am either buying stuff or they are updating a game like this video right here so we're gonna go ahead and get into this all right so here we are uh earn points for hell earn points for hell so it does not matter which mode you play we're gonna do normal because i feel like we could beat normal very easily so we're gonna just go ahead and do normal where the heck is the map all the exits come out right here actually this is probably easier than what i should have done oh well here we go so you start out with a ton of money actually which makes this fairly easy for me uh the last map that it, whoa what the heck they spawn out of portals i just realized that that's so cool oh god there's a lot of stuff okay maybe we should start making money on these guys right now so we can actually survive this because holy cow i did not expect that much stuff to spawn holy cow <laughs> Should be good, though, because we've got a pretty stacked team, honestly. Of course, we have Soul Reaper, which is a huge help. And, of course, we got our Kairos and the other towers for AoE, which we're definitely going to need in a second. So let's go ahead and get them down. I actually wasn't prepared for them to do a Hell or Heaven only game mode. So I kind of don't have the best tower setup going here. Like I should have way better towers for this, but I don't just because I wasn't wasn't ready for them to do something like this. But it is what it is. We have a pretty dang good lineup here anyways. If you guys are wondering why you're seeing all these xbox controls i'm playing on my xbox but recording on my pc the only reason for that is i actually thought it was better quality because i wasn't using my pc but it turns out on my editing software that i was doing something that i wasn't supposed to when i was exporting it from there so i found that out i can record on my pc but the problem is with that is that my center screen is actually my xbox and my two outer screens are my pc and i don't have a setup to switch the center screen to something other than that so as of right now we're gonna keep it as it is but i really hope in the future if this youtube thing goes anywhere which i hope it does i will of course change it up and you guys won't see these weird little icons like the the x above the uh soul reaper right here and the little outline that won't be there but if you guys have been playing this um i'm sure you guys know by now this mode is very much based on aoe i have really good towers here and they're doing honestly nothing i mean you could have better towers but i have some 
some pretty good towers and they're doing nothing. But once they get to the Kairos over here that have not really the, the best of stats, because I can't really buff them the way I would like to, because you can only place demon towers on this map. They only have 199,000 damage, but their AoE is pretty decent. Nothing compared to Amon Ra, but you can only place Amon Ra on the other side, on the hell maps, because he is actually a holy tower, I believe, which I did not know. I, I had no idea. And then I looked at it when I was playing the other mode and I was like, oh, that's a really good tower to use. But oh my God, look, they spawn everywhere. What the heck? They're spawning out of there, out of there, out of there. Okay, hold on, guys. We're just going to go over there. There's so much stuff spawning right now. Holy cow, my game is like tripping. But if we, if we really look, like how many spawns are there? There's one. One, two, we're just going to count the paths at first. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then seven in the middle right here. And then eight and nine. There's nine different spawns, but they all end up at the same path. So it's actually pretty dang easy if you have an AOE tower. Preferably Kairos, because I think that's one of the few that work on this map that are good, I think. I don't know. I haven't been paying attention to this game much lately. I've been playing other games just because... I got burnt out, I guess, from this game for a bit. But I mean, I'm back on it. I don't think they were updating as much either because I think they were focused probably on Battle Pets, which is their new game, which I also upload on this channel. Uh, subscribe if you want to see content from that because I will be posting all the dragons from the dragon event in that game. Uh, I will be showcasing every single one. I won't be playing in the game, but I will be showing you their stats on every single one so you guys can get an idea because I have beaten the whole thing and I have all the premium towers. So I'll be showcasing that in a video this week. So if you guys aren't subscribed, turn on the bell notification get notified subscribe um i will be uploading that soon but i'm gonna skip to when the boss spawns as you guys can see it's pretty much just repetitive stuff here. There's a lot of stuff spawning i mean insane insane amount of stuff spawning so i'm gonna skip to when the boss spawns so you guys can see that all right i know i said i'm gonna skip to when the boss spawns but i just got i just want you guys to take this in real quick look at how much stuff spawns right, i'm just gonna do a slow walk here this is what the path looks like right now this is insane oh i have a soul reaper over here that's awkward nobody saw that all right i i definitely knew that was there the entire time we're not not gonna talk about that right we're not all right i'm, I'm lying you can put down in the comments i mean I, i'm dumb for leaving the soul reaper out in the middle of nowhere that wasn't doing anything but holy cow holy cow <laughs> okay, so here's the boss is that 10 mil i think that's 10 mil health uh that's a lot of health and there's also a ton of stuff on the path oh he's deleting my towers oh lord oh lord oh he just deleted the one i placed come on now what? he's just choosing the towers i'm placing what are you doing my man wow i didn't know i had to replace over and over but i guess i do oh we are not even fighting the boss yet that's pretty nuts he is deleting stuff like over and over and over and over that's crazy this guy is wow honestly should probably place over here instead for now he just keeps picking every tower i place what is up with this guy stop it can't even place them fast enough i don't want to know what this map's like on the hardest mode like he will not stop deleting my stuff and he is now three two one dead we didn't get a tower okay well i don't know let me know down in the comments if there's a tower that you get for beating this all i got was a token and a banner all right so we're gonna switch up our team here real quick and i'll get back to you okay so we have a team now as you guys can see i have super good damage and absolutely no buffing for my team surprisingly don't have really any good holy buff towers whatsoever i need to probably need to get some but i don't have any so here we go into the demon temple we will open the two coins that we have uh demon and holy coins after this we're gonna go ahead and do the hell reaver we're gonna do it on hard again i think or normal i think we did normal we'll just stick with normal you guys are probably like why aren't in, why isn't he doing actually a harder mode because he has almond rock i don't have boss killing stuff and almond raw is good and all but he does not kill bosses very well so yeah sorry he kills bosses well but not when he doesn't have a good damage buff i should put it that way so we're basically just gonna have the same setup over here again let's do the same exact thing there's not much different we could do and pray to god that we survive because my towers are honestly not that good not making any money oh we're gonna die we're so dead I don't want to talk about it. So we have Almond Rub, but all of our low level towers are absolutely terrible. That's what I was trying to get at. So we're just going to go straight to farming damage money here. See if that won't help us majorly. Okay, maybe we just try and save up for 60k now that we got this. Yes, we're perfect. Awesome. Let's kill this stuff and boom. And, and, and. Today, Junior? 
and boom almond raw and we're set automatically one look at that range look at that range automatic win no questions asked see what i mean though without a damage buff like almond raw is kind of i mean he's good but not insanely broken like he should be now it's just absolutely easy from here of course we have maxed out almond raws the shiny is with nightmare and the other one's not but it has infernal which is about as good also let me know down in the comments what's like a really good holy holy team buff tower like is there an epic that you can get to level five that is really good other than like rat god i know rat god's like a 10 percent, but is there something higher than that that i don't know of i'm sure there is please let me know down in the comments because i don't play this game enough to pay attention but we should be good considering our non-shiny almond rods are doing 178,000 with well that range and our shiny ones are doing 297,000. they are absolutely just wiping out everything and anything that comes through the path as you guys can see look at this insane amount of path so from the heaven i've noticed from the heaven world they spawn from up in the sky which obviously makes sense because the heaven and hell thing heaven's up there hell's down there or so they say and they're coming out of the ground they don't really have like a cool anime like the heaven guys are like falling from the sky ever so slowly and the he and the hell guys look at the hell guys they have like a cool animation like they get out of the floor or anything they just appear <laughs> Like, look, here you go. They don't, like, rise up or anything. They're just, I'm here. I showed up to the party. Time to kick some butt. There's not really much to show in, in this. Pretty much just Almond Raw is absolutely deleting everything. So I'll cut straight to when the boss spawns. So you guys can check out that wave. I'm sure he's probably going to have the same ability as the last one where he just absolutely deletes my towers over and over and over and over. So there's going to be a lot of replacing and upgrading on that wave. I just know it. Are you sure about that? Anyways, I'll cut back to it when I get there. Okay, so here we are in boss wave. And here's the absolute insanity of over spawn that spawns on this wave but there is the boss the hell reaver so i'm i'm probably dumb you guys are probably saying why didn't you just hover over the left side of the menu when you're loading into the game to press play and see what the rewards are i didn't i'm gonna do that after this match so we could see if this is where we get the tower because i'm pretty sure this is how we get the towers it's probably just a percentage chance that you pull the tower from beating this guy it's probably like a one percent or a two percent something really low this guy seems to actually not delete towers like the the last one was the last one was a pain in the butt but this one has not deleted anything we'll see if he deletes something when he gets closer but as of now he hasn't deleted a single thing all right so now the boss is finally in the range of all the towers and it is getting absolutely deleted the almond rods are just putting a beating on this guy actually oh there we go oh he does an aoe attack that's not fun don't do that come on now that's messed up he's gonna die anyways to the almond rods before all my towers even get destroyed boom gone and dead so we didn't get the tower of course we just got the token my luck sucks as you guys probably know if you watch my channel actually the battle pets video that i made recently was some pretty super good luck in that game so now we're back in the lobby we actually beat both of those we're gonna go open the tokens real quick and then we're gonna load back into a match and check out what the rewards are from this because i'm pretty sure the rewards are probably from beating this i have yet to get any of these towers if you guys have any of these towers let me know if they're worth going and beating this over and over and over wow we didn't get any from those of course but yeah let me know down in the comments if any of them are worth it and we're gonna load back into the match and check what the rewards are real quick so yes as you guys can see right here oh the percentage actually increases the harder mode you go so easy mode it's only one percent to pull the urn for the tower normal mode it's a two percent and it just stays two percent through the rest of the mode so basically the best mode to play is normal because you have a two percent chance of pulling it along with two percent for the pet and 100 percent for the holy token i have actually pulled multiple tokens from this uh i don't know how that works i thought it was only specifically one per game but i guess not you could also pull multiple so i'm gonna go back to lobby and end off this video but if any of you in the video have seen this uh let me know down in the comments if the towers are worth getting along with the towers from the summons i'm gonna end it off here i don't got much else to say this was pretty much the update yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and as always don't forget to like the video subscribe comment down below the question of the day which was what is your favorite subject in school mine was auto class and don't forget to turn on the bell notification get notified every time i upload because i will be uploading a couple more times this weekend i usually upload on weekends because that's the only time i have and with that being said it's been real and it's been fun so that means it's been real fun i'll catch you on the next one peace